The government is not delivering the things the community wants. They are arrogant and they have stopped listening. Here's an alternative. And still they don't listen. What do we want? Now! What do we want? Climate action! What do we want? responsible for a politician to not take immediate and drastic action surrounding the climate crisis and investing in more roads and highways over public transport is very much included. This isn't a simple matter of people inherently preferring cars over buses or trains because they're less busy or easier. It's a problem with our politicians not making public transport more accessible and preferable to the average person. What's become really, really apparent is how out of balance decision making in this state has really become. The government lack imagination. And that's at the crux of it. So they can't possibly understand or imagine what it feels like. If you use gas, you are part of the problem. There is no such thing as good gas. There is no such thing as transition gas. It's a problem. We need to get rid of gas and get onto renewables. And methane is causing the biggest issue with climate overall. So don't be fooled by, oh, I might get my gas from Bass Strait or wherever. Gas is a major problem. Can I say this? It's not that they're not spending money on things. They're just spending money on the wrong things. They're spending money on polluting toll roads like West Connects when we still don't have fully accessible train stations across our network. They are spending money, they are spending money on outrageous things that we do not want and failing to deliver on the community services and the infrastructure that we do want. What we've also seen is $14 billion of waste. $14 billion of projects that are not finished, that are over budget, that have destroyed trees and environment and have, have, and have left a giant, giant scars across New South Wales and particularly in Sydney. That $14 billion will, we will never get back. But it is a shame on a government if they think that they are good managers for them to waste that money. Think about what we could be doing to invest in our environment, in our heritage, um, in our waterways. Um, with 14 billion dollars, that is gone.